All right, so John, I wanted to ask you a little bit about taking the exam at FX uh, course study. And first, if you wouldn't mind talking a little bit about, you know, why uh, we chose exam FX. So exam FX is a great computer program that uh, we found is one of the best to, to prepare you for your uh, test. Um, we've got a high success rate in rolling through it. It actually focuses the information as you go through the simulated exams to pare down what you are missing and focus on that. And we found that we have a real high hit rate on people passing their tests with it. Does it take a long time? It shouldn't take a long time. Um, really, you should be able to get it done in two days. Uh, kind of what you want to do is, is get through the quizzes and the chapter reviews rather quickly. Uh, don't really worry about passing or failing, just kind of skim through them. Then you want to get to the simulated exam. Once you're to the simulated exam, it's going to be about two hours per time that you attempt it. After the first time, what they're going, what it's going to do is, is give you some crib notes. It's going to send you back to the areas that you need to study. And at, what you'll find that after you take it a few times, it's going to start paring down the information, throwing out the stuff that you've been getting right, and it's going to pare it down to the things that you've been getting wrong that you need more of a focused review on. After about four times, it's really focused in on you, and you're probably set to go. So you ought to be able to finish everything within about two days. So after I take the test, it's going to give me crib notes, so I don't have to go back and find the answers to questions or review the actual test. It'll actually show me that stuff? Yeah, that's actually one of the things that we really like about it is it cuts down on the time of trying to go back and find what you've missed and find the inf correct information. It actually links you to the exact spot in the text where you should be studying. Okay, cool. So skim the chapter quizzes. Take the simulator exam. Now, when I'm taking the simulator exam, is it just basically the same exam over and over again? I mean, are they going to ask me the same questions? Is it the same difficulty? What, what happens? Well, each time it's going to, again, take out the stuff that you've been doing correctly. So the first time you'll take, of course, everything with it. And then as you get things correct, it'll start to remove those and then focus in on the things that you've been getting incorrect. So because that's the stuff that you really need to be studying on. And so as you don't uh, have some more issues with that you go back and you study it again and then you come back and you try to do it as you pass those items it's going to remove them and so it really focuses in on the things that you're having an issue with all right so the test is actually getting harder for me the test is actually getting harder so you may see a little bit of a dip in the uh, 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 scores as you move along but don't get discouraged because it's actually focusing on the things that you're having a problem with and we find that after people uh, go through it about four times they raise their uh, point differential about by 10. So. Oh, about 10. So if I get like a 65, that's like a 75? Yes, you'll end up with about a 75. So if you get a 65 on the practice, you probably will end up with a 75 on the, on the actual exam. Okay, cool. And is there, uh, like I'm in Texas, how many times can I take that test? You can take it as many times as you need to. So uh, I believe the time frame in between is about five days from when you fail, uh, if you don't pass it, to being able to retake it. Okay, and uh, failure is what? Uh, you've got to get a 70 to be able to pass. So seven, so 69 doesn't get you there. 69 does not get you there. Okay, cool. And uh, when people are going through this system, what's your guys' pass rate? It is about, I'd figure it's around 80, 85% on going the first the, time. Going through the first time? Yes, sir. Okay, and most people go through it, like how many, do you have a lot of people that don't make it, like after the second time? No, uh, after the second time, usually the, the second round of studying really helps focus it down and cleans it up for them and they're able to pass it. Okay, awesome.